Hello YouTube, I just watched the last episode of season 4 of My Hero Academia. We're picking up this because, um, I will talk about him a little bit here. Uh, if you want to go check out his channel, it'll be down below. It's the Grim Reaper. Uh, the only reason I know about him is he reached out to me and asked if I want to join Discord and it was way back. And he does a lot of stuff. He doesn't do as much as I am because I have a incredibly long workload each week to pick up and do. Uh, but he does a lot of One Punch Man. If you guys really want to sit down and talk like theories or they have, I think, a One Punch Man podcast and that. If you guys want to go check them out, I'll put them down below. I'll put him down below. If you want to go check out his videos, they are amazing. Uh, I'll give the credit to him. Uh, he probably won't see this video. So I can talk amazingly about him and he won't even see it. I do this all the time. Um, if you, you guys are not, uh, if you guys don't know me well, I don't really talk bad about people. I've never actually seen the point of talking bad about people on camera, actually at all. Uh, so I only tr I try to talk good because he's a really amazing content creator, and uh, he is definitely. I think he's a bigger channel than us. But we might be catching on him. Even if we do catch, I do eventually want to go on a podcast and talk about One Punch Man with him. But that's even... I'm in his Discord, but I'm even afraid to ask to join that. Because I look at his side of the channel, I'm like, we're close. But I don't want to ask to do it because I feel like more of a burden at that point. So let's throw that aside. Um, he won't see this, so I can talk about this all I want. Uh, like I said, One Piece manga is incredible to talk about. The other problem about doing podcasts with them is I fuck I fuck up stuff. I would fuck up stuff so quickly because I'm bad with names. I'm horrible with names. I do like what twelve. I go up to at least twelve different mangas and up to like so many new series. Like remembering just Arthur or. Shinra or other people from Fire Force took me the entire season to do so. Uh, doing stuff like that takes me forever. So if I name things wrong or I forget names here and I have to look them up, I'm sorry about this chapter for doing that. This is chapter 130. It doesn't have a title yet. Uh, usually doesn't get released title until probably uh, a couple of days later. But this just came out because he released a video, I think last night or earlier this morning about it. Don't leave my side. So we have Fubuki, Bang, and Bomb here. I only know Bomb's name because I had to look it up like six different times throughout chapters in the past like year. I had to look up his name like seven different times and now I've memorized it. <laughs> Don't leave my side. And she has a barrier around all of them. The floor and everything is collapsing because if you remember last time, uh, the entire structure is collapsing because... Um, Guro, or Psychos, Psychos, and, uh, the Monster King has formed together, and they're destroying the entire ground. Everything should be okay, as long as you stay by my side. My sister would never hurt me when she's using her power. So, it actually looks like Tasumaki... It looks like Tasumaki is rescuing everybody in here. Every hero, which is fucking incredible. I don't think she's rescuing Saitama because she doesn't know Saitama is here. Uh, and Saitama has this weird relationship back and forth with her where she she keeps apping. I just want to see them fight because if she sees how powerful he is, then it might stop. But she is definitely Sundari, uh, which is amazing. Um, looks like uh, Bang. Uh, went to step and almost stepped into the crater. Good thing they had the barrier. Without this barrier, it would have been game over. Please thank your sister for me. My sister is such an idiot. Oh shit! Oh, I forgot! Fucking Child Emperor's inside the natural water. And... It's no good. My consciousness, it's... 
Thank God Tasumaki saved him right there. Put a barrier around him, got him out of natural water, otherwise Child Emperor would have been dead. I don't want to see him dead, because I still expect high things for him. <laughs> Give me a oh, fucking wrong water bottle. One is for work, one is for work. The other one down there is for when I go to work at a grocery store at overnight and stock shelves and do that. Ugh. A barrier, and you can see the other three samurais that were with Atomic Samurai, his group there, all have bubbles around them too. Is this? Even Fatcom got a barrier around him, but Fatcom's barrier is like the entire length of him. And get, it's getting pulled from Gums, but I think Gums is trying to stop it. I thought my ass was glowing all of a sudden. It feels like I am enveloped in a warm embrace of love. I don't know what's going on, but I will call it Angel Aura. Oi! Can't even... It can't even do Angel Float? <laughs> you have Pure Pure Prisoner naked inside his bubble. Oh, and then you have, uh, the fucking, the guy who is a, he's A, A, uh, A class rank one, and I have a poster over there of him. I can't think of his name, so I'm sorry, uh, but that bastard, uh, who is fighting Ugly God because he can't stand ugliness, uh, gets put in bubble too. I'm dizzy, and my body feels light and fuzzy. Why are you floating? Oh, and then I forgot. And then you have, oh yeah, a uh, homeless god uh, is still fighting an atomic samurai. An energy spear just appeared out of thin air. There's nothing on the inside, huh? Oh, looks like she didn't get. Uh, he, she didn't get Zombie Man. <laughs> I forgot his name for a second there. Tasumaki, is she trying to help me? The torn pieces of clothing inside the spear. The terminal, terminal ch child emperor. Child emperor. Sorry, I said homeless god. No, they, he's talking about child emperor. Isn't it? Ugh, fuck, I can't think. I can't think of that enemy's name now. I'm fucking up. I'm fucking up because I'm all flustered. Um, the terminal child emperor gave me is in my pocket. That's how she's pinpointing our location. Damn it. Had I known, I would have kept it inside of my skull. Flash's ter uh, terminal. So it shows his log that got lost in the water uh, being picked up too. Huh, again? Did that lump of flesh sense this is the way they are retreating together? Ah, duck. This is it. And a big bowl is coming down. Fucking Saitama fucking. <laughs> it's very hot in the room. Uh, Alexa, lights off. Alexa, that's like on. And he, he's stopping it all with his punch. He he's standing up though, and he leans back and just goes straight up. He's if if he was on the ground, he would do be doing a split. I could, I can't even do that. Well, I could. I I could. I did it. I was able to do it back in like third grade, but ever since then, I've lost the ability to. I can get my foot behind my head, but that's still a difference. He stops it, though. That's the... That's it. The end. Oh, Black Sperm is fighting Atomic Samurai. Atomic Samurai gets saved. What's this? Tasumaki. My apologies. It looks like an intermission. You don't run away from me, Atomic Sandbag. The walls are 
There, the walls are closing on on in on him. Atomic Samurai puts his sword away, cutting him in, uh, into pieces for a last retort, so he can't stop the walls crushing him. Farewell. Oh, uh, that bastard again! Farewell, special blade tested monster. And you see Tasumaki with her aura around her. She's has her hands up, but I'm thinking that's because she's saving everybody. We're only 10 out of 26 pages in. I'm... I need to calm down. I need to calm down. I, I need to calm down. I need... I need... <laughs> okay, uh, don't ask my ways of how I record or the re ridiculous of me. I also need to get a new face. New camera, because that one loses focus a lot. Uh, I said... Shouldn't say a lot. I think it's because I keep moving around a lot and it keeps trying to focus back in on me. Or do stuff like that and it might lose focus. Which is, is doing its job. It's just... Every time I look over there, it's like, oh, it's lost focus. Why? It's because my face is so fucking ugly. It just loses... Okay, I need to stop talking. I need to stop talking bad about myself. Does it help with my <laughs> self confidence? Uh, okay, so we see the combination of Psychos and the Orochi here. Took me a second to remind, remember Orochi because Orochi's been used in like five different animes at this point as a villain source. This output. So, in other words, you were holding back. And she puts her hands in front of her and then, e <laughs> e yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'm guessing she she actually does this. It's not like e <laughs> uh full uh straight up. Uh, I'm guessing she's sending them all to the surface. See everything above shaking. Thinking that Saitama's home that's shaking right now, too, that we see. In the fucking earth! The earth shatters in six different locations. It's like a fucking earthquake happened, but three fault lines overlapped. Wow, fault lines are not... Is that the right word? Fault lines is... I, I don't think I've ever used fault lines in the fucking sentence correctly. And you see everything being brought up. What the fuck is being brought up? What is she bringing up right now? Out of the ground. You have people at the... Hero Association looking at terror. As you can see, Z-City. All the ground is coming away as this thing is being brought up. Tosamaki is bringing something up. I think it's the whole layer. It is! So, she brought the entire Monster Association city up, the entire catacomb system of the city, up into the sky, up above ground. The tremors have stopped? I'm surrounded by a strange light. Amazing, this must be the legendary Super King's state. No, it's Tatsumaki, but uh, King can get more word. Ah, what the... And King's looking out, realizing they're super high now. And the elevator snaps. Oh, shit. And they're falling. And you see a crank to stop the elevator if something happens. He's grabbing it as hard as possible. Uh, it's not working. My, gr gris my grip strength is way too low. And you can see it's just shooting down the elevator, but it gets stopped by something. The elevator gets stopped by something. That would have killed them. That would have been like Mary Mary Jane when Spider-Man caught her in the movie. I don't actually know if that's Mary Jane. Spider-Man, The Amazing Spider-Man 2. Good movie. Uh, King, what are you doing? Genos. Where's Sensei? You should have joined the battle. No idea. I don't know. 
where he is. Or if Fubuki and the others are safe. Blood. Blood. Eek. What is this sticky stuff? We're being surrounded. They're, at, they're on the street at this point. It seems. Because you can see a uh, line going through. I'm guessing that's the center of the street line. <sighs> Excuse me. Janos just does releases all fire to the surrounding area or blasts. I'm sensing a massive life form at the top of the the pro construction. Oh, and she ends the other tower on top of the tower. It was like a regular city block tower. Uh, gets set up and with it too. And Tasamaki's under it. And she, you can see blast waves as she sends herself through the entire building. I don't know what she's doing, but it just, it seems like she's attacking it. From all angles and straight down, like a wrap in the t tower. But I don't know what she's doing with this. She blows off the top of the tower. Look at the fucking artwork. It's fucking amazing. Um, you can see all the landscape behind them. The, like the cracks go on forever, but you can also see really far in the distance. And the top of the tower breaks, and you see the form, of, the hybrid. Of the Orochi and Psychos. Come out the top of it. It's now an air battle. Actually. I wonder. If they're out in the open. The heroes might actually have better times fighting the cadre at this point. Because they could work together. Uh, because I don't think one of the S class heroes can take on a single cadre at that point. Hoo hoo. Finally, it's time to end this. You have Tasumaki heading in for the battle between those two. It's fucking amazing scene work. You can see all the ground and the cities just at different bends. I want to see how they fucking repair this because they need bridges or something for the city after this point if it is able to be able to be lived in after this point. And you see, uh, you see Saitama and the monster. So dark. Oh, fucking end of the chapter. Oh, fucking what the fuck was this chapter? What the fuck, man? I got a few ideas for a thumbnail. But still... If I did the kick for the thumbnail with my foot up in the air, could I put the text above it and then have Tasumaki also hold up the text? And the kick the same way? Maybe. Maybe. Uh, I got an idea, but I don't know. It'd be cool. Uh, it's not going to work out as I think uh, because I would have to have the images giant. I don't like doing that. I like having them somewhat big but not too big um just like it the perfect size for insertion oh fuck me i need sub i'm being a fucking pervert at this point now um i'm very uh, i don't know why i go that way uh i just go that way uh because it's the line that needs to be crossed sometimes um if you guys like video of like um if you guys haven't subscribed to the channel recommend subscribing to the channel I'm giving this 10 out of 10. This was a fucking amazing chapter. I can't even predict how the hell this will go from this point on.
Okay, um... Uh... I don't know at this point. I don't know... Uh, I don't know what to talk about. Everybody's away from battles, so there's no battles to talk about other than Tatsumaki versus Orochi. Orochi and Psycho's combination. I think Saitama or someone has to go help her. I don't know if she's powerful enough to face it. I'm actually being serious here. Also, if Saitama can get out there... Flashy Flash already knows Saitama's power at this point. At least seen a fraction of it. If he can get out and actually start helping fights... With the other S class, S uh, the other S class will actually know how powerful he is, and it might actually boost his rank a shit ton. He's in what? At this point in the manga, is he still in B class? Yeah, because Fubuki tried to get him to join that group. He needs to be promoted to B class one and then put into A class. At least then he'll be called to situations more often than anything else. And they already know his power from him beating the sea monster and other foes beforehand because they have surveillance. Oh, what the fuck? Um, I don't know what else to say. Uh, this video is really long at this point. Um, longer than most videos uh, for my one, one punch bed, but I went plus ultra. But what the fuck, man? If you guys like video, give. Oh, I already said it. <laughs> I got fog in the brain. I got goo in the brain. Um, if you guys like, uh, if you guys, uh, my brain malfunction there. Um, have a good morning, have a good afternoon, have a good night, wherever you are. Just have a good day. Hopefully, I see you guys in the next video. Like I said, this is 10 out of 10. I can't wait for the next chapter. And uh, also, like I said at the beginning, if you want to go check out the Grim Reaper, check his channel down below. He's fucking amazing uh, with his content. He does a lot of One Punch Man, uh, but he also does other things. Uh, I would say One Punch Man is probably one of his m major things on the channel, which I give him credit for. He's uh, incredible in... Uh, He's figured out what to be incredible at, and he's just proceeding with that. So, uh, otherwise, really just thank you guys so much for watching, and hopefully I do see you guys next video. Uh, otherwise, uh, peace.